Imagine a force of nature so powerful that it can rip buildings apart. Imagine winds swirling faster than a race car. Tornadoes, those monstrous whirling columns of air, can unleash winds up to 300 miles per hour. That's the raw power of nature at its most extreme. It's a force that demands our respect and understanding. These swirling vortices of destruction are a sight to behold, but their beauty masks their incredible danger. Understanding how these natural disasters form is crucial for our safety and preparedness. Tornadoes are violently rotating columns of air that extend from a thunderstorm to the ground. They're often visible as a funnel-shaped cloud with swirling debris and dust near the ground. These funnels of destruction can vary in size from small and relatively weak to massive and devastating. Tornadoes form when specific atmospheric conditions collide, creating a perfect storm of instability and rotation. Understanding these conditions is key to unraveling the mystery of tornado formation. Predicting tornadoes is a complex and challenging task. Unlike hurricanes, which develop over warm ocean waters and follow a more predictable path, tornadoes can form rapidly and unexpectedly. Meteorologists use sophisticated radar systems, weather balloons and computer models to monitor atmospheric conditions and issue warnings. Despite these advancements, predicting the exact location, timing and intensity of a tornado remains an inexact science. The unpredictable nature of these storms makes accurate forecasting a constant challenge. Pause. Three wind, temperature and atmosphere. These three elements are the key players in the dramatic and often destructive phenomena we call tornadoes. The formation of a tornado is a delicate dance between wind, temperature and atmospheric pressure. Each element must align perfectly to create the conditions necessary for a tornado to form. It all starts with warm, moist air near the ground and cooler, drier air aloft. This warm air is typically found in the lower atmosphere, close to the Earth's surface, where it can be heated by the sun. This difference in temperature creates instability in the atmosphere, like a pot of water simmering on a stove. The warm air wants to rise, while the cooler air wants to sink, creating a turbulent environment. As the warm air rises, it creates an updraft, pulling in more air from the surroundings. This updraft is a powerful force, capable of lifting large amounts of air and moisture high into the atmosphere. If wind conditions are right, this updraft can begin to rotate, forming a spinning column of air known as a mesocyclone. This rotation is crucial for the development of a tornado, as it provides the necessary spin to organize the storm. This is the first stage in the birth of a tornado. As the mesocyclone strengthens, it can begin to stretch downward towards the ground, eventually forming a visible funnel cloud. If this funnel cloud makes contact with the ground, it becomes a tornado capable of causing significant damage. Tornadoes are one of nature's most awe-inspiring and destructive phenomena. They begin their life cycle in the heart of a thunderstorm, where the conditions are ripe for their formation. As the mesocyclone spins and strengthens, it can stretch vertically, becoming narrower and more intense. This mesocyclone is a rotating updraft and it is the precursor to a tornado. The process of vertical stretching is crucial as it intensifies the rotation, making the system more powerful. This stretching process further amplifies the rotation, like a figure skater pulling their arms in during a spin. The tighter the spin, the faster and more forceful it becomes. This is a critical stage in the birth of a tornado where the energy is concentrated and the system becomes more organized. If the conditions are just right, a funnel cloud may begin to descend from the base of the thunderstorm. This funnel cloud is a visible sign of the intense rotation occurring within the storm. It's a dramatic and often ominous sight, signaling the potential for a tornado to form. When this funnel cloud touches the ground, a tornado is born. This moment marks the transition from a rotating column of air to a full-fledged tornado, capable of causing significant damage. The contact with the ground allows the tornado to draw in more air, further fueling its strength. The exact mechanisms that cause the funnel to reach down and connect with the surface are still being studied adding to the complexity and mystery of these powerful storms. Scientists use advanced technology and field studies to understand these processes better, hoping to improve prediction and warning systems. The birth of a tornado is a testament to the incredible power and unpredictability of nature. From supercell to touchdown, tornadoes are one of nature's most powerful and awe-inspiring phenomena 
They can cause immense destruction in a matter of minutes, leaving behind a trail of devastation. Understanding how they form is crucial for predicting and preparing for these violent storms. Tornadoes most commonly form within a type of thunderstorm known as a supercell. These storms are unique due to their rotating updrafts, which are essential for tornado formation. Supercells are often isolated and can last for several hours, making them particularly dangerous. Supercells are characterized by their rotating updraft, which provides the spin necessary for tornado development. This rotation is caused by wind shear, where winds at different altitudes blow at different speeds or directions. The updraft tilts this horizontal rotation into a vertical one, creating a mesocyclone. As the supercell moves and evolves, it can spawn multiple tornadoes, each with its own path of destruction. These tornadoes can vary greatly in size, intensity and duration. Some may last only a few minutes, while others can persist for over an hour, causing widespread damage. The intensity of a tornado is measured using the enhanced Fujita scale, or EF scale, which ranges from EF0, the weakest, to EF5, the strongest. This scale takes into account the damage caused by the tornado. To estimate its wind speeds, an EF0 tornado might cause minor damage, such as broken branches, while an EF5 can obliterate well-built structures. The EF scale is based on the estimated wind speeds within the tornado and the damage it causes. Meteorologists use this information to better understand the tornado's strength and potential impact. By studying past tornadoes, scientists can improve forecasting methods and help communities better prepare for future storms. Tornadoes are a stark reminder of the raw power of nature. They can level homes, uproot trees and hurl debris with incredible force. The devastation left in the wake of a tornado can be heartbreaking, underscoring the importance of preparedness and safety measures. It's important to remember that even small tornadoes can be dangerous. Never underestimate the power of these storms. Taking shelter and heeding warnings can mean the difference between life and death. Living in a tornado-prone area requires vigilance and preparation. Knowing the warning signs of a tornado, such as a dark greenish sky, a roaring sound like a freight train or an approaching wall of clouds, can give you valuable time to seek shelter. Having a plan in place, including identifying a safe room in your home or workplace, can help ensure your safety during a tornado warning. Remember, when it comes to tornadoes, preparation is key. Scientists and meteorologists are constantly working to improve tornado forecasting. Advances in radar technology, computer modeling, and our understanding of atmospheric dynamics are leading to more accurate and timely warnings. The goal is to provide communities with as much lead time as possible, allowing them to take appropriate safety measures and minimize the impact of these devastating storms. The future of tornado prediction lies in continued research and innovation. Tornadoes, with their awesome power and unpredictable nature, continue to fascinate and frighten us. They are a testament to the complex and powerful forces at work in our atmosphere. While we strive to understand and predict these storms, we must also respect their raw power and the importance of safety. Tornadoes serve as a reminder of the delicate balance of our planet and the need to live in harmony with nature. Tornadoes are just one example of the many wonders and mysteries of the natural world. From the depths of the oceans to the vastness of space, there is so much more to explore and discover. By fostering a sense of curiosity and a thirst for knowledge, we can unlock the secrets of our planet and inspire future generations to protect and appreciate its beauty and power. Our journey of discovery has just begun. Please leave your thoughts on the comments section and do not forget to like our video. Thank you.